and what is this? The buff flame arm. 15 keys. I've been able to defeat the friendly shark, but I haven't been able to get to the Kraken ball. It takes a lot of time, effort, and energy. It's important for you to have the best one if you can get there. This is probably about, I've been close to RGB and I've spent it all on rebirthing and pet. Rebirthing is very good for your strength, not super rebirthing, just regular rebirth and your upgrades, right? If you decide to super rebirth. The problem with rebirthing, which I'm gonna show you guys exactly what happens, and I didn't notice this until today. If you use this enchantment, what happens? happens is it takes away from your rebirths so let's just say i am 740 percent damage if i use any of this right here it actually decreases my rebirth and i get weaker but i do gain whatever it is for these pets so whether it's lucky winner winner i gain it on my pets but i get weaker so it almost forces you to rebirth again but you use up all your wins and you have to restart all the way oh it's been a grind let me tell you also i I went ahead and bought pets. I have 10 out of 10 pets. I actually bought VIP as well because listen, I needed to, I needed to grind. We currently get 334 million every time we box this golden punching bag. So it's good. I'm at 36.7 trillion strength. And at one point I was at 500 trillion strength, but I didn't realize that my rebirth was so low because I spent so much on my pet. Pretty much every pet has winner winner. And I think one pet has some type of lucky to it. So it has lucky three. If I fight anything, I want to be able to get as much wins as possible for rebirths. So normally, I wouldn't be able to get 450 million wins. I think that's a million. I think since I have so much winner winner, I get like a higher percentage. Now, as far as the pets, some of these pets are really good, but I think I have the bolt. And do I have the thunder? No, I don't have the thunder. I have the bolt, and it's just not as good as some of these other event pets. So I've been working on event pets. I got 1,040 event pets, and that's what I've been grinding. We're gonna move on to Atlantis because Atlantis. Atlantis leaves in three weeks and I've been grinding a little bit of Atlantis. Did they fix? Okay, they finally fixed the pull-ups. I could do pull-ups, but look at how weird I look. Like, look at how dumb I look doing pull-ups. We're gonna talk about that. I don't know what's wrong with my arm either. It's glitchy, but I'm 246 trillion strength. Still not strong enough to fight Poseidon. I don't even think I'm strong enough to fight this warrior yet. Oh, yes, I am. 78,000 wins. Not bad at all, but these pets are so expensive. One pet is 58 million. It took me a long time to get this 58 million pet, but I'm gonna go ahead and buy it. I'm gonna see hopefully i guess i get i get the citrus crab citrus crab which is rare it does 2500 damage yo i like that so we get to equip that and now we have a lot more damage so these are actually glitchy but they take forever to get so really the only person who's gonna give out good enough wins is poseidon and yeah we're not like yeah like come on now 1.3 QA in this world. And I feel like the boost doesn't even work. We're gonna open up a lot of crates, but we gotta get into the rusty crates first and hope that we get something crazy. We did get a pretty decent arm. Uh, this one, the hobo arm, not good at all, right? We, let me go ahead and show you my arms real quick. Get off of here. So let's open 10 and see if we get anything crazy. We get the zombie arm. No, the cacti arm, the cacti arm. Not anything crazy. Cacti arm is 20%. Let's just go back and open all. No, 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 no. I just wanna open all the rusty crates. Can I do that all at one time? I can't use more what's the percentage bionic is 35 percent 500 is the crystal maybe we try and get a mythical one maybe we got that juice and no we don't have the juice we get another hobo arm i wonder it would be cool if you can fuse these arms together kind of like pets and make them better that'd be kind of cool look at who's close if we could fuse these and make these like super crazy arms Ooh, the void arm that looks kind of cool i ain't gonna lie let me see if i can change my arm and my arm doesn't look crazy it looks less broken oh maybe it looks like that because i have a trench coat on so my trench coat is like covered Covering up my, I can't take my trench coat out. That's my swag. You feel me? Let's open up these silver crates. I wish you could open up all of them without opening up all of them, right? So silver crate, you can get some spicy out of here. We get the toxic arm, which is 75% damage or strength boost. Can we get one of these crazy ones, like 140? Even though we got the other arm, which is already better. But let's look at the percentage on here. So we can get the buff steampunk, and we can also get the buff bolt, which the buff bolt will be decent. You know we gotta open up the diamond joints. Ooh, oh, I thought that's gonna give it to us. We get the toxic arm. I wonder, does the luck from getting pets actually count as luck from getting these arms as well or no? The flame arm, 95%. That's pretty good. The only problem is, like I said, we should be able to fuse some of these arms, you know what I'm saying? Make these a little bit stronger, man. A little bit, a tad bit stronger. If you get like 10 robo arms or hobo arms or rotten arms, you know what I'm saying? You could go ahead and fuse them. Let's see. Can, can we actually do that? We have no gold crates. Let's buy a gold crate. How much is a gold crate? 5.5 .5 billion. Let's get 10 gold crates. See, hopefully we can get something. One out of 10, we should be able to get 
get a decent arm 250 buff riding arm okay that's not terrible are these arms tradable i don't think can we get a ooh it's another 250 buff riding arm we're close close we might get something spicy out of here can we get something no they're not feeling this they're not feeling this okay we get it buff riding arm we get it seven more let's go baby we should get some spot yo that 470 i want it i want it i think that was a buff sandy arm yes what is this the buff flame arm we already got this right we got four more crazy spices we got a lot of keys man but ooh, we're set we got a lot of keys but we don't have a lot of crazy this crazy is kind of expensive 55 billion i ain't you know i ain't rich yet you know what i'm saying i'm kind of but i ain't rich yet you know i mean like i got a little bit of, we got a little bit of wins but we need a lot more than what they what they ooh 420 finally a better arm we get the buff bio arm all right this is our last key let's see if we get anything spicy can we get something below like 10 percent we get the buff bling arm 420 percent we equipped that was it 366 mil or was it 336 mil? got a couple diamonds i don't know how we got these but we're gonna see if we get some spice um, i didn't even check the list let's see we start off with a 530 percent buff spike arm you know we rocking that but let's see the percentages we get the buff crystal at 900 percent wow so 900 percent is the high and then you get the omega buff tiger you get the buff seaweed and the buff cacti okay so let's see hopefully we can get some uh, some spicy we get the 560 what's this the buff toxic oh we need that spice 25 percent chance to get that we got 15 keys we gotta get something crazy the spike arm i wish i could see what these things look like but i can't take off my trench coat i feel like i'm uh, the buff alien that probably look cool but if i take off my trench coat i'm gonna lose my swagger i'm gonna lose my identity you know what i'm saying i can't do that we get the buff primal arm okay we got a lot of arms to like switch up in between Ooh, seven percent buff crab arm let's see if we get anything better Ooh, back to back back to back buff crab arm see if we could fuse these together and make them like super buff crab arm that'd be kind of cool come on let me get something spicy here Ooh, 700 percent the seaweed arm no way we're getting that much damage boost let's go i've been saving these for y'all but this probably is enough for me to get to atlantis fully cleared get as the best pets i possibly can and then knock off uh the mutant king and then we get another 700 percent the buff seaweed arm so we got two of these now that might be three we now have the buff seaweed arm still looks crazy i can't see it can we see it underneath we really can't see it just from having a better arm we already have 40.3 t just from having a better arm so now let's see how much damage we do here still 366 i thought we, we, we should we shouldn't we be doing a little bit more do we like max out our damage or whatever about the rebirth thing maybe it's just me maybe my account be tripping i don't know that whole rebirth thing is kind of crazy to me but if it's not just me and that's really how it works y'all gotta be careful out here man because you might be grinding for a long time and then you end up screwing up everything with your rebirth regardless of the matter man i hope y'all enjoyed this episode eventually i will be able to move on to the nuclear bunker but for now now, back to the grind.